Sunday, November 8th, and Chase and I are set up. It's warm again today. It's like 57 degrees this morning when we got here. And it's supposed to warm up to the mid-70s again. We have a south southeast wind, and we're trying something a little bit different. I've never hunted this spot on the river bottom farm before. But uh, cameras and off-season scouting have uh, told me that this is an area where you can certainly have a good hunt in the morning. We're really not far off the road or where we park. But in the middle of this big wetland is uh, all these willow thickets. And there's just a lot of does that bed out here. So the bucks will cruise by and, and check them out. We've already seen six bucks this morning. One was a really nice three-year-old that came right out of the tree. And then we just saw the black-eyed ten again. That's three hunts in a row. And we, we heard some grunting over there. And then he was basically cruising down that lane. Last year this time, we had Merino uh, daylight active in this little thicket on November 7th, I believe it was. And I filmed Prodigy right here, November 2nd. So, historically there's always been some pretty good buck movement or at least a chance at it. We've hunted in and around this area in the afternoon before, but I've just never sat it in the morning. So I'm kind of excited to do something new. And I've also got Dak on camera right here. I don't think anything's been in daylight, but we're close enough to this thicket and bedding area that he certainly could be with a doe or cruising through here mid-morning. Hopefully here Marino makes an appearance. Jared's back in the peninsula. It'd be nice if one of us could lay eyes on either one of those deer. That deer's gonna be a stud, man. I mean, that's such an obvious three-year-old.
well, it's a little after 10 o'clock. And we had a great sit. You know, we had constant activity for the first three hours. Haven't seen anything for the last hour or so, and I've got some work to do, so I'm going to start packing up here. Um, we also, I almost got a shot at a coyote. You know, we even had a, a big tom come into the little watering hole, so lots of wildlife moving around this morning. The best buck we saw was the black eyed 10, and then we had that four and a half year old six by five come right here behind us at 50 yards. We also saw two uh, pretty three year olds. Supposed to warm up to 75 again today, so um, I'm not really sure if I'm gonna get out and hunt or, or what I'm gonna do, but we're gonna get packed up, get some work done, and then make a decision on that.